We need to take the equation given here and write it in terms of the normal way that we write a circle. So what we need to write it as is two perfect squares, and that will give us the uh, radius squared on the other side so we can find the radius. So what we have is x squared plus 2x plus y squared minus 4y equals 4. So we need to add some number to both these x and y parts to make a perfect square for both of these. Uh, let's try adding 5, and we'll see that we can split that up and make two perfect squares. So if we add 5 to both sides, we can write x squared plus 2x plus y squared minus 4y plus 5. Adding 5 to this side gives us 9. Then we can, in fact, write these as two perfect squares. We'll put 1 here and leave 4 here. So x squared plus 2y, x, excuse me, plus 1, and then we have plus y squared minus 4y plus 4. So this 5 is split into 4 and 1. This still equals 9. Then we can write these in the two perfect squares. Written as x plus 1 gives us this and y minus 2 gives us this. If you expand this out, you'll get these terms back again. So in fact, this adding 5 to both sides worked for us. So this is our r squared. This is the center of the circle, but this is our r squared. So r squared equals 9, or r equals 3.